POV. You're a traveler running through the woods. Nighttime's about to break. You're all on your own, and you're in unfamiliar territory. But then, all of a sudden, an explosion nearby. And then getting back to your base isn't so important anymore. You see, explosions are the most tempting sounds in Rust. They mean opportunity. Well, really, it means a base is getting raided, meaning that hours and hours, if not days and days of loot, is about to be exposed to the outside world, or whoever is blowing down that base's doors or walls. Now, being neither a member of the group that's getting raided or the group that's doing the raiding, you are unaffiliated to the situation. But all you know is that a raid is going on nearby, which means you have the opportunity to counter it and get all of the loot inside of that base. So, of course, you run over. By the time you get there, it's almost completely dark outside. You hear no explosions going on inside anymore, you don't hear any footsteps or anything of the sort, but the doors are missing. This was definitely the base that was getting raided. Now, your curiosity is peeking at campfires running and there's a dead body or a body bag on the ground inside. The lack of any sort of sound is kind of disconcerting, but you're a human being. Your greed drives you to jump inside the base. You begin to look through all the loot in the boxes, and there's loot there. This is a raid for sure. You keep going in further and further into the base, and then you see bigger boxes, what appears to be the main loot. So of course, you plan on opening one. But then... The sound of a beep that comes from you clicking on a locked box triggers the base owner to lower a ladder hatch. You are now trapped inside the base. The ladder hatch is blocking your escape. You're still in a state of confusion, so you continue to look around. But then, a switch opens a garage door, which exposes an auto turret that's off but pointed in your direction, and bulletproof glass, a shop front, with the base owner standing behind it. You understand what's happening now, you're no longer a passerby, you're not a counter raider, you're a victim. You've fallen into a trap base. No raid was ever even going on, the base owner was throwing weak explosives at his own walls to bait people like you to come inside. You see the switch that's on the wall beside him, you know when he flips it, the auto turret will turn on and you'll fall to your demise. You can try to run up the ladder hatch, but if you do, you'll just be in another sort of cage, and if the base owner opens the single door beside you, a shotgun trap will do just what the turret would. Maybe you can even try to throw your loot past the ladder hatch, if you have a teammate outside to pick it up, but odds are, you'll die before you can get much of it out. The harsh reality is, no matter how much good loot you have on you, no matter how good of a player you are, no matter how fast your reactions are, you are doomed. You have been outplayed by the base owner and his base. Now, this design is not simple to make. It takes a pretty advanced knowledge of the Rust electricity system and Rust mechanics, and it takes a fair bit of resources to actually build. But once the base owner completes it, the server turns from an island with hundreds of players running around on it to a pond where every player is a fish swimming around, and the base owner has a hook in with bait on it, prepared to catch as many players as he possibly can. The idea of having a consistent stream of loot coming in without having to farm or fight for it is appealing. It's something that in my 5,000 hours of playing Rust, I have never once done before. So in the tale that I'm about to tell you all, it was my main goal to make this base on a live server. Let's get into the action. My name's Stevie. Sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. As always, our story started where and how everyone in Rust begins. As a naked, on the beach. But this time it was a little bit different because this day was Monday, December 14th. But that's not really when all the action took place. You see, I was playing solo to begin this wipe for about the first day and a half. I was getting my start, getting established, so we're gonna skip through all of that so we can focus on the main part of this video, the trap base and the action that revolved around that. So we'll skip all the way to mid-afternoon on Tuesday, December 15th. As the title suggests, I was playing with someone else, a new player to the game. It was Kaz, FaZe Kaz, who's a Fortnite player that has never played Rust before and has hardly watched any Rust content. For those of you that are Rust players, you can imagine how difficult the game was when you first began. Ultimately, that's why I decided on making a trap base this wipe, because I knew with a new player by my side going around PvPing, raiding, normal things that a Rust adventure would entail would just not be reasonable. For those of you that don't play Rust, let me explain. Rust is not a game 
game you can just download and already be good at. It's not like there's a set game mode, like a battle royale or like a search and destroy that you can relate to and understand. Players that are new to the game may take dozens, if not hundreds of hours to get just a decent grip on what the game is all about. So the trap based action didn't actually begin until Wednesday, it was Tuesday. And the reason that I skipped to this day was because this is when Kaz originally got on for the first time in Rust ever, right after he had finished downloading the game. The plan was to show Kaz around the area so he could see what there was to see, show him some of the guns and the tools so he could get a feel for the mechanics and kind of understand the game a little bit. With that being said, my expectations for his Rust debut were very, very low, as they would be for any new Rust player, so we didn't take any decent guns out. But the outcome of this day was a lot better than I expected. <laughs> Hello. We're, are we both naked? <laughs> yeah. All right. So I'll invite you. So you should see if you open tab, you should have an option to join the team. Yes. And now <laughs> my funny. name tag will always be green when I'm at a distance. So uh, all right, cool. we can tell who's on our team. There's all no right. way to go third person, right? This is all first person. This is all first person. Yeah. <laughs> so this is our area. So let me describe a bit about it. Power plant, which you see 70, you see that big nuclear yeah, yeah. mountain thing. That's like the main monument I've been using to get my resources. And you can see it if you if you open your map, you can see all the shit that's around us. Um, right. That's where I've been going. There's a road down there, north, where we can hit components. You actually see a little guy down there. And, yeah, uh, can I shoot him? Yeah, you can, but that's like an impossible shot to do with like a gun like this. Like if we had a sniper rifle, that'd be easy cake, but. Oh. I hit him. Bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> then, actually, you see that base over there. You see past that little wooden, uh, like, lookout tower looking yeah. thing. Behind it, there's, like, what looks like the remains of a base, a stone base. I don't even know. If yeah, I guess. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's, yeah, like, yeah. the remains of a base. That base was, like, kind of like my main neighbors. They got absolutely pummeled last night. Raided, destroyed. And you see west, that base up there on the hill. Yeah. Pretty sure they got raided too and there's a base so why are these... we not scared we're gonna get raided oh we are we're terrified that we're in clan territory because if you look oh there's a helicopter up there west um if you look around on the map this is like a this is a pretty clan heavy area the the way you can tell is if you look up if you look around the map there are all these monuments the closer you are to monuments and how the like, more people are going to be there yeah the more people are going to be there and clans will build as close to monuments as possible to have you know the easiest access to resources so the, so uh, the clans that have like eight people yeah yeah they'll have like eight ten twenty people there's really no limit um you see launch site up that's kind of like up to the right on the map of us up to the right in the snow yeah that's like the monument that's that's the monument that clans live at that's that would be like clan hell so we're in a we're in like a decent area but there's been a group and i was actually in the woods like just doing my business farming yesterday and i hear these guys they're running through the woods they're talking in game they're like oh yeah this 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 clan's been coming through raiding every single base in the area and i was like holy shit dude i'm next Wait, were you talking to them? No, no, no. I was, I was farming, but I heard them running up, and so I oh. hit, I hid in a bush, and they passed by, and they were talking out loud, and they were like, "That's funny." Last night before I got offline, I was terrified that when I woke up, I wouldn't have a base. I've been farming all yesterday to make this. I guess we can just go ahead. All right, so this is there's a little technique. If you if you look, if you like slowly edge off the side, and then as you're falling, you run into the wall, you'll take less fall damage. Did that work? I don't even know if that worked. <laughs> yeah, I think it did. Now, nighttime in this game, you can't see a thing. When it's nighttime, you can't see unless you have a flashlight. No way. Well, you can already kind of tell. So, so what's even the point of having night then? Um, I mean, it does add realism, but it's a time for- Oh, oh shit. shit. Headshot him, headshot him. I'm pushing him. I just got- Are you dead? No. I'm popping mushroom.
50 in this tube. Touch on him. Oh, wait, he's not dead. He's not dead. He's over here. Yes. 70. No way. Touch on him. Full dead. Got him. Nice. Oh, he's in stack. Oh my god, he had an auto turret. <laughs> Holy shit, we can make a trap base out of this. <laughs> no fing way. Dude, that's actually so perfect. What the f Are you alive? <clears throat> yeah, I'm asking for a res, I think. Oh, okay, okay, where are you? You will die uh, middle of the street by Let's like see. the tube. We'll get this back to base and then. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. There's a guy coming in. Am I up? He's dead. Oh, my oh god. you just melted that kid. You got a pistol? Yeah, you can loot this guy's right. body. I'm really low. I need to like get in a corner and heal. If you can find that body, you can probably loot it. He's got some. You shit can't on. prone in this game, right? Uh, no, no, no. And his gun would Is have fallen on the ground. Is there a quicker way to take stuff to your inventory? Yeah, and that's what I was talking about. The quick loot. If you hold down H and swipe over everything, it'll like quick oh yeah, suck there it we up. Go. Yeah. And if you look on the ground, it'll be lying around somewhere. His gun. It should be like outlined in white if you hover over it. Oh, hey, I see it. Here, just try to follow me. I'm gonna turn my torch on. Okay, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna throw on- can I throw on clothes and stuff or not? Yeah, yeah, all the clothes you had on, just swipe them onto your inventory. Okay. Wait, wait, guy coming? Uh, wait, wait. I have a shotgun too. Yeah, we should- uh, we should get the f out of here. Just have that python out, that's- that's like a really good gun. Hold on, I gotta make some bandages. Yeah, all good. You see that guy to the right? Yeah. See, we could hold our torch out like that, and run to be able to see easier, but we're just like f***ing asking to get smacked, you know? Yeah. That like that like, kid, you could tell exactly. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like if anyone had a gun, like if I decided to shoot that guy, he'd just die. But that's probably the guy we killed running back. And you can kind of this is us? red dot of the door to yep. open it. That's funny, bro. Do we have lights in the house? Yeah, we yeah we can turn on campfires. How did you get inside? Oh, I went in before you. <laughs> and oh. then I closed it behind me. So some time passed and Kaz got a little bit more familiar with the game. He was trying out some weapons. We were finding a little bit of success, and we thought we were ready to run over to launch site. There were a bunch of shots in the area, and an airdrop had recently come in. We really didn't have that many guns in our boxes at this point, but we decided we would take two out and see if we could make anything happen. And there's SAR shots back there, so we might be able to get some here. Holy shit, dude, look at these nodes. All of this in this tiny ass area. That's I, like stuff you can farm, right? Yeah, like all these ones that have like that weird looking Is it sulfur? Like, ridges. Yeah, that's sulfur. That's there is sulfur, metal, and what? What other Stone. Rock? That's what our whole base is made oh. out of. They just popped a uh, airdrop to the left. There was purple smoke for a bit, and that pretty much calls in an airdrop that has like good tier loot in it. But they have a compound, so it's probably just gonna fall right in their compound, and there's nothing we can really do about it. And that's them shooting AK. Watch out, there's two guys ahead of us. Right here, right in front of you. One. I'll let you get that guy. Dead. Hell yes, brother. Let's go. Oh. Watch out. To your left, yeah, behind us. Okay, we need to keep going. Oh my God. Try to be like sporadic with your movements so we can't like lead you properly. Although he is shooting at me. Those are the shots ringing out of a bolt, bolt action sniper and probably on a roof. As is that probably. Oh wait, they're, they're, he's right in front of us. Holy shit, holy shit. You have saw, wait, you have saw, right? Yeah. So there's a guy peeking. No, 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 not from this range. But do you see him? Yeah. Oh, and he's on the roof there. Wait, he might have seen me. We might be able to get up close. What the? F what are they doing? We we can't kill at this range. They have metal armor on. We need to get a spray down. Come to me. Right here. Tell me when you're gonna start shooting. Yeah. You see the orange guy? Red pants, right? Yeah, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, go ahead. Wait, you turned around? Wait, wait, wait. wait. Yeah. Red pants. Go ahead. Hit. Hit. Dead. Nice. nice okay, nice. he's behind this two by two, his teammate. He's, he just died to Tommy. I think he just died to Tommy. Yeah, now the team far is shooting us. Yeah, I know. But, but we got to get to this base, to this AK body. If I get okay. that. You see that hazmat guy behind the rock? 240. Oh, I'm Watch dead. Out, I'm dead. If you get behind this rock, you can pick me. Yeah, there's a guy pushing somewhere. Where's my gun? 
Do you want my gun? I got it. Killed him, killed him. I killed the guy looting the airdrop. There's a guy in the base still. He's Sorry, getting mowed by Tommy. Come, come, come. With you. Good one. Yeah. I'm medding, I'm medding. I gotta pop, I gotta pop. Okay. There more? Yeah, inside. I'm, I'm gonna try to loot this body. Got to our left. Yeah. Killed him. I need a med. There's a guy on the roof, but he's naked. Okay. I'm with you. Might have a gun. These guys are loaded. See this guy, right? On the roof. He's just jumping. Yeah, he's fine. If you don't have a gun, he don't have a gun. Here, can you loot this body? Actually, I'll try to loot what I can. I can grab some stuff. I got an M9 pistol. Did you loot some stuff already? We I'm should just dip. swooping a shit ton of stuff. Yeah, we should dip. We should dip. We should dip. Okay. He's leaving the base. He's I hear somebody close. Just keep coming. Just keep coming. I'll cover. I got an M39. That's yeah. That's a really good gun. And the Spaz 12. Um, take this armor. Hold up. And put that on. Did you get an AK? Yeah, I got an AK. Nice. So, like, equating this to an amount of time, like, getting one of these is probably... Probably, if you were to just go outside and farm for 40 minutes straight, that's probably what this one gun is. No way. Yeah. And the thing is, you'll almost never find solos, duos, even trios, small groups, crafting these AKs. There's a guy straight ahead to the left. We'll go up to the right. So yeah, the thing is clans can like really easily make these because they're just like for the first day of wipe clans pretty much just farm like they just all go out They make a massive base and they just farm and like one of these AKs is 50 high quality metal Which is hitting one of those node things 25 times so when when small groups duos like us even solos trios get an AK It's like a really really substantial thing Oh, let's go. So somehow we had countered an airdrop that was coming in on the south side of launch site. We didn't get all of the airdrop loot because they got inside that little 2x2 two two with some of it, but we did get an AK and an M39 set, and Kaz held his own. He was providing cover fire while I was looting, and even before that, when we were shooting at the first AK guy that we killed, he was hitting shots. But the good kept coming. Like, because that M39 with the kick it has is is not a... I probably... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Did you shot at? Yeah. Are you good? We kill him? The one? Yeah, I'm good, I'm good. The other guy's still you alive. The guy. uh, I, I, I didn't kill the first guy. Hit three times, dead. Nice, dude, good shit. All right, I'm looting this guy on the left. You loot the guy you killed. Oh, they had components too. Guy in front. Yeah, coming down the street. Double dummy, dead. In the background, back there, yep. Yeah. Hit him. Hit him. Dead. Dead. Could be another, could be another. I'm healing. You can go and push yeah. or, or just uh, hold for now. Tell me once you got all this Hazmat. stuff. Hazmat. A lot of potatoes. Why do you have 30 potatoes on his body? Oh that? my god, this guy's loaded. Nice. Oh, we had a turret too for the trap base. It's perfect. Oh, high external stone wall. That's good. That's good. Ele electric fuse. Wait, is this, what? Is there a body or something? I was just looking at the blue ahead. Okay, okay, let's go. Let's go. What the hell? That's what? That won't that won't do shit. That's the Chinook. All bark, no bite. It uh, it flies around the map every once in a while and drops a crate at one of the monuments. And the crates have really good loot. Oh wow. Yeah, but then these things shoot M2s off the back, but they like miss every bullet and do zero damage. <laughs> so it's just like kind of pointless. As more and more time passed, Kaz was getting more and more familiar with the game, and after several hours longer, he got off for the night. I stayed on for a while, fortifying my compound, which, yes, was built around the sulfur quarry. Now, if you are wondering why I built here, how I was even able to, I'm gonna leave that explanation for another time. Like I said, this video is just focusing on the trap base and how Kaz and I managed to pull it off. And it happens very soon. I went to sleep with our base nice and secure. It was more of a fortress now, but when I woke up the next morning, we weren't raided. 
thankfully, because like I'd mentioned, groups had been going around raiding all of the bases in my area. With the compound and the base pretty much completely done the previous night, the goal for today was to get everything ready for the trap base, and then when Kaz got on, eventually make the trap base and begin seeing what we could do with it. So for now, I was able to go to power plant and get all the resources that I would eventually need to make the electrical system in the base. Now I had a bunch of farming that I needed to get done, and I did it. I'm gonna breeze through it because, you know, it's not that entertaining to watch, but I'll kind of explain what I needed. The base in the beginning pretty much showed you exactly how the trap base would work, or at least our initial plan for what it would look like. We were gonna need an auto turret, door controller, switches, a medium battery, a generator, wires, it was going to be a lot, not even to mention all the resources it was going to take to just put the base down, stone and then metal fragments to make all of the doors and such that were on the inside. That's what I was doing for most of Wednesday morning, but after a while I ran into someone who killed me when I was farming. His name was YY and then a bunch of numbers. Shortly after, I ran into him again, and then again and again, and what I realized is that he was solo as well. I was solo because Kaz had not yet got on, and we kept running into each other. This was unproductive and we would both die and lose resources, so we eventually decided to team up, because in running into each other so much, we were essentially blocking each other from progressing with our wipes. I would kill him with resources he needed, he would kill me with resources that I needed. Now, we weren't in Discord or voice comms or anything like that at this point, but we were under the same team UI, meaning we would know who we each were from a distance and know not to shoot each other. Also, because both of us were running low on the resources that we needed to make meds and ammo, we decided that we wanted to go to Outpost. I ran over to Bandit Camp with 750 scrap, which I traded in for a minicopter, and then I took us both over to Outpost, where we bought everything that we needed all of the resources that I would need to eventually put the trap base down. Not too long after the run, we pretty much had all of the resources we needed to make the trap base, and everything crafted that we needed to place inside. Kaz got on, and now all we needed to do was figure out where we were going to build it. Holy, that's crazy. Look at that AK guys over there. That's gonna be our f***ing domain, and we can see it from here perfectly. All right, so I'm thinking... In terms of the place I want to put it, it's right in that open spot between the mining outpost and that like little bunker looking base that's down there. Right where that AK guy shot. That's where I, I want to put it. see a guy running in that field. You see him? Uh, On the right side of the street, further side? Further side? Yeah, I do not. Wait, is my draw distance down? I don't see him. There. Oh no, I don't see him. But somewhere around there is where we'll put it because there's a lot of traffic. Maybe even more to the right because it's closer to power where groups will be. Yeah. And then we'll also be able to see it from up here. And I have a, I got an M39 silence. We also have a bolt sniper rifle. So we'll have a good vision over it. If people start to raid it, we can spawn up here and, and put in some work. Um, and like kill them off from the outside. I'm going to tell our pal what we're planning on doing. Make trap base near outpost and power. <laughs> he said, LOL, go for it. I'll tell him we want to catch some clans. Maybe he'll be in on it. So I disconnected from this server for a little bit and hopped over onto a build server. These build servers give you unlimited resources, kind of like creative mode in Minecraft where you can build whatever you want to test out base designs without actually having to farm for them. I wanted to test out the design, to test out the electrical system and make sure everything was fully functioning and that I knew how to build it on the spot before we built it on our regular server. Because when we were putting it down on the regular server, people would probably be trying to stop us. And if they killed us and grabbed our resources, everything we had been working for to make that base would just be gone stolen. But everything looked good. I knew I could make it on the spot, and I knew we had the resources and the items to build it already in our boxes, so we were ready to go. I disconnected from the build server, loaded back into the original one, got the resources I needed on me, and then we ran over. It's daytime now. This is gonna be so interesting. We put our wire above it now. Yeah, we're all secure. People got to try oh really goodness, hard. Oh my goodness, yeah, this is homeboy. Bro, why do you guys have, like, way better outfits on than me? <laughs> you guys both are astronauts. I'm like a... I'm a wolf. That's true. So, I don't know if we want to build closer to mining outpost. God, my dogs are howling in the background. Um, closer to mining outpost to the left? Or further up to the right? Alright, he's building it. The, the TC's over here if you want to get access on it. Okay. 
ability of the tool cupboard. Every single base has it. It's like the the heart of the base. Oh, this guy. Oh. I think he smoked him. This guy is nuts. <laughs> <laughs> oh, true. This guy went crazy. All right, sweet. All right, we'll get back in base. Oh, this is going to be a good little area, I think. Oh, I'm getting shot. Get in, get in, get in. Okay, I got this. Ooh. M39, guys. That's a scary gun, be careful. Dude, why I don't care, bro? He's running up. <laughs> why I crazy? Just sitting here. Maybe pop up. Are we going back inside? Yeah, I gotta grab some more stuff. I just built the outside of the base pretty much. Now I gotta get all this stuff for the inside. Okay. Is that close? Is that oh close? shit! Why do I spray one of them down? Yeah, yeah, there, a helicopter just came by close to the ground. Why do I just fucking beamed his ass? Look at this guy's body what? <laughs> oh! No. What? Loot the rest of this. Come here, come here. Down here, down here. What, is this dude cheating or something? No, no, no. Loot this, loot this. Just loot it. These guys just were on an insane farm run. Oh my god. No way. Yeah, yeah. I swear to you. I swear to you. Here, we need to get back inside. I need to type this guy. And he beamed two of them? No, no, no. no. The, the driver got away with the minicopter, but two people can fit on one. He beamed the guy off the front. They were driving low, though. I don't know why they were driving so low, but they went about probably 30 feet above the ground, and he just melted the first guy. I cannot believe that shit. Like, I mean, I know this doesn't um, really mean anything to you, but there's the screenshot of what he had. Like, sulfur, that yellow stuff I talked about, that's like the the most yeah, valuable yeah, yeah. resource in Rust. You said like ours made a thousand, right? Or what? Yeah, ours, ours makes every, <clears throat> every 10 minutes, it probably makes 500. And this what? guy alone had one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, Bro, almost they gotta be ten thousand. No yeah, like that's that's an absurd amount of farming to do. That's like a. They bought a mini copter to fly to the snow away from their base because a lot of nodes spawn there to farm for a long amount of time to just come back and us to yoink it all. It's crazy. That sucks, bro. Holy shit. <laughs> yeah, no, I feel bad for them, but then again, easy. Uh, jackhammer. Oh yeah, true, and they're they're pretty rare. So we're gonna smelt this for YY because we have large furnaces, and he doesn't, and then give it back. All right, let's just go. Hey, oh, this is looking good, dude. Clean. So now. Oh, lovely. Oh, lovely. It's working? Okay, the, the full trap should be in effect. So do you want to stand there and we'll have YY come in and do the honors of being the little bait? Whoa, wait, what do you want me to do? Just stand up top? Yeah. And remember, the second you open it, just fly into these doors. Okay. Can I just have this door open already? Yeah, yeah. Just ready to get in. All right, he's coming. Assume just there go. are no doors. Just go in. Whoa. Like you're going deep. All right, now he's trapped. All right. <laughs> hello, my friend, hello. All right, has he gone up there? Yeah, he's stuck up here. <laughs> <laughs> hello. Go back down. They come up here, huh? There's a shotgun trap in that doorway, or there will be. Oh, oh shit. Okay, wait. <laughs> All 
Alright, it worked perfect. It that worked. gun's- that gun is ter- the P2 in the turret is terrible. I need to put a better gun in the P2. And also, I almost forgot the shotgun trap, he's right. <laughs> he's like, what happens if I come up here? Uh, yeah, nothing. So it had all worked perfectly, except for the turret taking forever to kill YY, who was giving the trap base a test run, but that was just because there was a cheap pistol in the turret slot. We changed that out for a Thompson, and then everything was ready to go. But before we started baiting people to come over, we made a camera station across the street, halfway up the hill, a little bit hidden, pretty far away. But it had a camera on the side, meaning that we could look through that camera via a computer station in the second story of the trap base and see exactly what was going on outside. We thought that having that outside view intel could be helpful in our trapping process. See, look, you ready? I'm gonna put it in. Oh! Alright. Look at him on the computer. Now look, hop in, All right. and select trap watch one. Wait. See in the bottom left hand corner. Oh no way! Yeah, so you can see everything that's going on live. What? So that that'll be your spot. Why why we'll take what whatever you did, closing the garage door. So we'll have everything covered. It's gonna be perfect. Should we uh add them to Discord then? Yeah, we should probably now. Oh, that's such a good sight. Oh my god. All right, I'm gonna go grab a snack. Actually, I may I may go eat because my family's eating dinner right now. I may go eat dinner, but it'll only be like 10 to 15 minutes, and then I'll be back. Okay. And by then, it should be the next morning time in Rust because the night's coming soon, and then we can start trapping. Then and add YY if that works for you. Now, as is not uncommon when amazing things happen to me in Rust, my hard drive decides that it wants to be out of storage space, and the footage that I record corrupts. But if you thought that my hard drive was going to get in the way of some banger content, <laughs> no, not a chance. I proudly introduce YY, or Vio as he's called. He was recording the entire experience, as was Kaz. I'm going to be switching between their POVs as the beginning of this plays out before I clear up hard drive space and am able to see from my perspective again. He plays on ultra wide resolution, as you guys can see, or aspect ratio. I'm going to cut that down to 16 by 9 for the viewer experience. Yo, hello? Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. How you doing, bro? I'm doing great. Just got a few guns. Yeah, that is. Nice, nice. Kaz, you there? Yes, sir. All right, we're ready to do this. <laughs> Take a look on the uh, camera station. Huh? Huh? That's dirty. Wait, is that, that, <laughs> That's is that a... just a random outside or is that? Wait, what? There's a Where? He's just sitting outside of it. Where? <laughs> Look on the camera. He's right outside the base. Like door camping? Yes. Wait, alright, tell me where he is. I'm gonna go clap him. <laughs> Give me yeah. eyes on him. Hold on, hold on, hold on. He's to the right of the door. He's like crouching around. He's staring at the door. Not exactly. He's just to the right of it. And then he's speaking. Easy. Man, I'm How gonna, gonna get one side. He's gonna take the doors off. Yeah, we'll take him off. I'm thinking of making some sat. Oh, you good? Yeah, so we just chucked a couple satchels up top on like a or like on one of the metal floors or some. Sh we remove the doors. It'll be perfect. There's been hella AK dudes by power just fighting. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. If they pull up, they hear the explosions. They kill two hazy guys on the roof. They see their two doors missing. They're gonna go in, you know. But I'm gonna hop outside. You you just stay ready. They have just left. Oh, that's, that's M2 on the ground. Oh, shit. I'm gonna throw another satchel. I'm gonna throw another satchel. Um. Don't be super obvious. Are they just... I'm gonna, I think I'm, I think I'm being too obvious, honestly. Did they leave or? No, he's still just sitting up there on the hill with that M2. Hello? Hello? There's an M2 guy on the ground outside. We're trying to bait him over here with satchels. M2, I don't know what that is, but let's go. All right, hold on. Let me open OBS. It's like a golden scar times 10. <laughs> Holy shit. All right. Do we say bad words on this channel or no? Oh, yeah, we can say bad words. All right, he might come. He might come. <laughs> he might okay. come. Okay. Wait, did you just die? Uh, yeah. Can you look on the camera? Can you look on the camera? Yeah. Do it quick so he doesn't hear you opening it, because it makes a noise when you open it. Just quick hop in. Alright, I did it. 
All right, once you hear the beep, open it, YY, all right? Mine, Mine outpost. outpost. Yeah, he's on top of that right now. Okay. You see Boy, it, right? I'm going to run. Yeah, yeah, I see him. I see him. I'm going to run. All right, he's <laughs> killing me. He's, he's killing me. I just Did saw that me? on 4K, bro. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. I'm going to come back from another bag. Yeah, yeah, this is me, okay. this is me. Oh, don't get killed again. No, I'm, I need to. Go in, maybe, and start baiting Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, that's perfect, that's perfect. I was jumping in. He sees that there's no door. Oh my goodness, he's just moving around up there. He's not jumping down, though. His, his teammate might. His AK teammate might. Oh my god, somebody's coming towards it. He's coming through the tree. Wait, he's wait, coming wait, wait, in. Wait. He's going in. Wait, wait. 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 Get ready. Wait, wait for you to hear the beep. Wait for you to hear the beep. He goes in. He's coming in. He went in. D is he closed? He's, all, he's, in, yep. he's in, he's in, he's in. Okay, okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna spawn in the trap. I'm gonna spawn in, I'm gonna spawn in. I'm Should gonna... I get out of the camera? Uh, you, you, you can, yeah. He's, <laughs> he's trapped in there. <laughs> okay, I saw okay. him through the slits <laughs> in the, the ladder hatch. <laughs> <laughs> no way. Is he there? <laughs> yeah, dude. Hey, bro, here. what's going on? Get up there, get up there, get up there. I His friend's on the outside. <laughs> wait, he's, wait, he's passing stuff through. Oh, he's passing everything through. I, I hit him once. I hit him once. He's running. Oh, he on the right. He on the right. What did you get? I got Tommy. Five bullets out here. Oh, wait, wait. He's he's so lit. He's so lit. He's so lit. That's everyone. Da, 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 da. Nice, nice, nice. I got M2. M2 should be on the ground on the back. Can you hop inside with it? Yeah, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got AK too. I'm coming from in. No way, dude. Did that, that actually, actually work? worked? What? <laughs> yes, it worked. I mean, no. Oh my god. Oh my god. You Why have M2. Naked? Yeah, I got M2. <laughs> Our first fucking victim, and we got an M2. Are you kidding me? That That's so not good. Good. This guy has so many heals. Who was this? No way. Bring it all inside. Bring it all inside. Yeah, bring yeah. that. Grab everything. Yeah, get it inside. Our, uh, we need boxes up top. Yeah, I know we do. We need them bad. Get wood and metal frags from TC. That group lives in the base up on the hill. They're yeah, going to come exactly raid it for the M2 right. back. Like a thousand percent. Should I just take <laughs> this and go back to... We, yeah, we need to go back <laughs> no to main way. base. I can go back to main right now. I got two AKs in them too. I'm going to go straight to your airlock. Right, this is me. I'm back. I got a few Tommies as well. <laughs> oh my god, can I, can I take a look? Yeah, yeah, take a peek, take a peek. Oh my goodness. <laughs> That's them back there. It was Ooh. so quick too. Oh my god. They were like, right as we finished it, they're outside. But this was not the end of our trapping. We were just running all of the good loot, including the M2 back to our main base, just in case those guys decided to come back and raid the trap base. And despite already getting an M249 from our first trapping session, the best was yet to come. If you see him nearby, I can start baiting. You have AK, right? Yeah. Oh, spray your AK a bit right now, and maybe they'll come over that way. Okay, that should be good. Alright, get ready to spray AK again. I'm gonna spray Tommy. Go. And then stop. I don't... Um, dude, this works so well. I know what? Wait, I'm gonna type in all chat. Raid... Q12. They have. Wait! So there's a car there's coming! A car. Spray your AK! Spray your AK! Spray your AK! Spray your AK! Alright, alright. All right. You good? Is that you in? Wait, someone's about to jump in. Wait, wait. Are you in? No, 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 no. Leave Somebody's leave. inside. Don't close it. Don't close it. It's a naked, I think. Right? Shoot, Shoot AK again. Shoot AK again. See if they turn around. There's literally somebody under. Yeah, no, it's fine. It's fine. I'll kill him. He almost killed me, but I killed him. That car just went past. I don't know. That'll be going. them, but... Wait, they're coming back. They're coming back. Wait, I'm gonna... I'm gonna... Shooting they're inside. Right. They're driving right up. This is red wolf. Wait, they inside the front door. 
Oh, this guy is bad. Oh, he's dead. I mean, this guy. <laughs> I'm dead. Wait, he may jump inside. Wait, get ready for the beep. Okay, one, one, one jumped in. One, is wait, one in? Wait yeah, for the yeah, beep. yeah. Wait for the beep. I'm closing. Where am I going? Wait, wait, but they're gonna pass loot through. Did you turn the I turret can't see on? see shit. I think he, I think the door's open. Yeah, close the door, just... close the door. Are you He's dead? dead? He's dead. There's still a guy outside. There's still a guy outside. I'm headshot by something. Oh, I'm getting rocked to death. I killed one. I killed rocket launcher. Kill the other one. Kill the other one. Nice, nice, nice. There's a naked. There's a naked about to loot. There's a naked about to loot. Dead, dead, dead. Oh, I just flicked on his ass. Nice, nice, nice. I'm coming to loot. I'm coming to loot. There's another naked, I think. I'm outside. Okay, okay. I'm, I'm looting. I'm back out. I'm in the dark now. Okay, I put the front door on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm just crouching around in the dark. <laughs> Did we just get a new whip? Oh, it's a fully armored car, dude. Holy shit. Oh, I'm gonna do some taxi rides with that, huh? All right, I'm gonna go eat real quick. Is that cool? Uh, yeah, yeah. Oh, has he, has he, has he? Dead? Nice. Okay. Um, I don't have much room to loot, but... It's the same guys from earlier, the AK guys. Sniper? Yeah, this guy's name is Kira, I remember him. Kira, yeah, yeah, Okay, I got their guns. I'm just gonna leave. Nice. Yeah, what were they doing? Dude, that that first guy was a bot. Like, he jumped out, he shot me with an incident, it didn't kill me, and he, I don't know what he was doing. And I was like, alright, I can't look that stupid. Like, I have to shoot back. Like, I can't just not shoot, or he's not gonna run inside, so I shot at him. All right, they may be DB camping this gate. Oh, I have no extra 5-5 on me. Should be something here, right? I grab 16. There's a stack. Nice. I'm gonna get a not hideous random kit on. Maybe not. I swear I've tried. Oh, wait. There's a scrap heli coming over this way. Oh, oh, you're oh LR guys. And bolty guys. Yeah, yeah. Do you want me to spray this AK? Yeah, yeah. I get ready to go inside. Okay, go inside. Oh, they're shooting oh. at me? They're shooting at me? Is the door off? No, I'll take it off, I'll yet. take it off. I sprayed some inside. Go outside and like jump around and be looking inside. Watching. They're just standing over there at the power lines. They may come to you. They're they're running past mining. They're coming over. They're coming over. I'm gonna get in my spot. Dude, he can't kill me. I'm waiting for him to kill me. I'm dead, I'm dead. Okay. Should I respawn inside or out? Oh uh, just wait. Out. Yeah, wait, yeah. I'll tell you if they jump in. Okay. One, no, no, he didn't jump in. There's two full medals. They're looking, they're looking, they're looking. One jumped in, one jumped in. He hasn't passed yet. Other, other jumped in, other jumped in. Wait, I'm gonna wait for him to pass. I closed it. Are they stuck? I don't know, I don't know, I'm about to open it. One's out, one's out, one ran out. I think one's got stuck, I think one got stuck. Oh yeah, he did, yeah, he did. They're passing, they're passing right now. Should be dead. What do I do? I can slap a door on. I don't headshot him, he's still alive. I can spawn at the other side and grab a kit. Yeah, I would. He's running far. They started passing shit through as... He's running towards many of those. Okay. He's already, he's kind of far already. Okay, I'm running to him. I only have one med in AK. I don't even have many meds, I'm like 60 HP. I he think he might get money up post. Hit him twice. Uh, uh, he's past, he's past the power lines. Okay. I got his bolt in his uh, road sign kit, so. He, had, he just had Tommy and Bolty. I don't think they got anything through. Like, I really don't. I mean, maybe. Oh, he's getting AK'd at. 
He's it's getting AK'd? Okay. I'm coming, I'm coming. They're they're fighting right now. He's healing. There's another Hazzy guy coming up behind him. I don't know if he's with them. See at power lines? Uh, no, he's past that towards the road uh, by sewer. I whiffed on Star. Hit AK three times. Where are they? He's still in those rocks up there. Hit AK. I'm getting suppressed. I'm getting suppressed. Wait, it's from behind. Killed the Star guy. I don't know where I'm getting suppressed from, dude. Ran. I'm full dead to like a suppressed AK at 80 meters. I don't know who or where. Do you know where he is? No, there's a naked at the electrical thing I in between us. No, I, I can't. Like... See on you? Nice. I see him. Where? In front of me? Like right in front of me. In the ditch? Yeah. I'm hit once. Yeah, he's just in here. Wait, there are two more guys coming from far. One dead. Okay, hide. I'm down, I'm down. Okay. I was like in the open. Yeah. I don't know how you I think they're same team with him? Maybe. Killed one? There's one guy left. I have no HP or heals. Okay, but where can I loot? Do you know. Oh uh, yeah, come to this log. Like it's almost directly on me. Okay. Wait, he's pushing up. Body shot, headshot him. Headshot him again. Where's the? Where's I'm the dead. End? How is he, he dead, not dead. dead? I got his loot. I know this guy. I saw the AK. I'm talking about last night. I looted him. My mic got unplugged. Where are the, oh. They're at the log. Double the one guy. Hit the other guy it, twice. If you stay alive, I can I can loot. I can oh, loot. Again? Oh. Are they dead? Are they dead? Uh, there was a SAR guy that killed the guy that killed you, and I killed him. I may have killed the SAR guy. Did I loot that guy? He had my AK, I think. I have my MP5. Did you loot the rest of my MP5 body up here? Nope. Okay, I'll loot it. Oh, I didn't have anything. Low? Oh, I know. I didn't loot it. Never mind. Okay, I'm pushing over to you. There are probably grubs in here. Do you think that first guy that you killed over there had... It wasn't looted? Because it would have oh, turned to a bag. Okay. Yo, what loot, do you say? Can you loot the rest of this? I'll loot it. I'll loot it. Oh, so this guy probably looted it, right? How many AKs do you have? Uh, Three. Oh, okay, yeah, then we got it all. Let's go. Wait, double headshot, body shot doesn't kill at like 20 meters with MP5? That's dumb. I'm gonna leave one kit in here. Oh, <laughs> we never put a door on. I just left this ladder hatch open and then turn it on. <laughs> Dude, that, that kind of like, I mean, we didn't trap anyone, but we killed his teammate and indirectly that caused a fight that indirectly we got loot off of. <laughs> Basically, we trapped them. Yeah, yeah, we, we pretty much just trapped those guys. They were victims. Yeah, Dude, it's crazy how much shit we've got from this one little puny base. Yeah, I know. Dude, the Jenny was on in that last one, so they were like, that's why they were hesitant to go in, because like that means a turret's on or something. Still got one of them, though. Yeah, I know. I need to remember to turn it off. We didn't really have high expectations for this trap base, but so far we've gotten quite a bit of loot off of it. After not too long, Kaz was back from eating. We had crafted more explosives to continue to bait, and we ran over to the trap base to continue trapping. I'm just watching camera while you're outside. Hey, like my little spot, Kaz. You see me over here? I can barely see you since you stopped. As long as they don't come from where the camera is, then you're chilling. There's a full metal, there's a full metal. Where? Where's, power plant? Where's power plant? He's okay. looking at you. Oh my god, okay. there's like three of them. Okay, three. okay, okay, okay. Oh they're, my they're god, there's cast. like four of them. I'm dead, I'm dead. Okay, 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 here we go. I'm here. They have rockets. They have a rocket launcher. They might start raiding it. Okay. I'm just chilling here. Wait, wait, wait. Well, one's gonna kill me. Unless he doesn't see me. No way he doesn't see me. Can we close it yet? 
Are they in? Yeah, they're in, they're in. Close, close. Open. It's nice. Not, it's, I did, I did, I did. I'm gonna kill them immediately, okay? So they don't raid or anything. Uh, I see one on the outside. There are three in there! There's three in there? There are three in there! They're getting mowed down! <laughs> no way! Put the door on, put the door on! I can't, there's a guy on the outside. Okay, they're, they're gonna pass shit through then. Dude, throw an aid, throw an aid, throw an aid. <laughs> I threw an aid on him, I threw an aid on him. He's dead! No way! Get that coat on! I got the door. Oh no, I got the green coat. Green, green. Yeah. I closed it! I closed it! We got it all! Oh my god! Oh my god! No way! Loot up, Kaz! Loot up! <laughs> they all came in there loaded! They are loaded! No way! I need an AK. They still have a friend outside. You want to triple bum rush them before they all, all get back? We could. Bro, I have this AK now. I've never held such a powerful weapon. Yeah, that's a, that's a big deal. We might throw Kaz out first just so we can trade. What? <laughs> okay. <laughs> no offense. Give me some, give uh, you some wanna ammo. Go? You wanna go? Give me some ammo. Someone give me some ammo. Here, here. I can throw you the rest of mine because I'm gonna die right away. The coach. Right, two, 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 two. Put the code in. Put the code in. All right, get, get in. Uh, go ahead. Go ahead. Actually sick, dude. Kill him. Where's he at? Oh, he's, he's playing. Nice. He's dead. Yeah, yeah, nothing. No, nothing. What? No, one was full metal outside, right? Oh, but he he dipped. He dipped. We need to get this whole to main base right now, like immediately. <laughs> this is getting raided. They had launchers on them. They are coming to raid go? this. Yeah, yeah, let me get this LR body. Um, they had bro, so that's insane. Much. I only saw one guy moving, and then you were like, "There's three. Oh my god, hold on. Let me let me put a top in here. I'll just do it quickly. No way, three of them bum rushing. Dude, no way. Okay, okay, let's dip now. Let's dip now. Let's get the fuck out of here. Yeah, you gotta go. Go, 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 go. Run. Oh my god, that was even better than the first <laughs> one. Full metal guy up to the right at our base. Up to the right at the camera base. He's behind it. Hit him twice. He's wide peeking. Dead. Nice. So that was that. We ended up getting all of the loot back to our main base. Actually, before we did so, they cut us off again and killed all of us. But you better believe we pulled out the M249 that we'd gotten from the first trap base run to thwart off the assailants who were trying to get back the loot that was rightfully ours. We did so successfully and got all of the riches safely inside. And that meant in the two hours that we'd been running this trap base so far, we'd acquired a row and a half of AKs, an M249, an LR, a bolt, over a box of high tier armor, two rows of hazmats, and three rows of S. SMGs. Also note, I have never in my 5,000 hours of playing Rust made a trap base on a live server at all. And before the previous day, Kaz had never played Rust. From the beginning, I just didn't expect this endeavor to turn out as successful as it did. Of course, YY or Vio was a huge help, and we wouldn't have been able to accomplish what we did without him. But also, Kaz did amazing. He understood exactly what he needed to do for the trap base to work properly, and he did it every single time. And <laughs> I honestly think by the end, despite maybe not fully getting everything that was going on, he was having a good time. We all were. And so the trapping continued for hours and hours. I mean, we were trapping clans, not entire clans in the tiny little base at one time, but the M2 guys, the first ones we trapped, they were members from a known clan that lived up on the hill behind power plant. The four man, where we had trapped three of them, the one that you just saw, they were from a bigger group that I'd been running into all wipe long at power plant and launch site. And in something that I'm not going to fully show you because it would take a long time to show, we trapped two two full metal members in the base. By looking through the camera system, we could see that there were six of them total, four outside and two trapped inside. And within two minutes of them getting trapped inside our base and us taking their loot, they were raiding it. They raided the trap base and they got their loot back. They did so successfully, but they didn't grief the base. So we were able to rebuild it and all they got was their loot because we were constantly transferring every little bit of profit we had back to our main base. I mean, I could go on and on explaining everything that played out in the hours to come, but I think to sum everything up, it was an unexpectedly successful day. After several more hours of trapping, Kaz got off, and Vio and I were about to as well, but I wanted to give away the trap base. I wasn't planning on using it the next day. I had had my fun. We had had 
our fun. So from the tippity top of the tower on my roof, I looked over the area. My area. M2 proudly out in my hands. Vio and I spotted what appeared to be a solo player who had just put down a 1x2 right behind our trap base. Perhaps he would be the perfect candidate to receive the base, to put it to good use for the rest of the night and for the days to come. And so I spawned over there and began talking to him. Hello. Friendly. You have Mike? He's scared, dude. He's not talking to me. Hello, my friend. You have Mike? Oh, there are two of them. They spread me down. What did you have? You were naked? I was just naked. Fair enough. I'll spray them down. These guys weren't friendly. They're going to get the gat. Uh, a bear just spawned beside me. No, you cannot make this shit up. No way. Oh, wait, hold on. I see a problem. No way. I'm dead. No way. Dude, how, dude. Dude, how unlucky. Oh my god. I... A bear. No, I'm not even getting a bear. Wasn't there, and then it spawned beside me, and it hit me, and they knew I was outside. <sighs> it's so true. And the bam. Oh. <laughs> and I spawn in in an outside bag that's in like the opposite direction of the base, and the and the bear had wandered all the way over here, and it's cutting me off. And like I'm in a fight. There's like six animals trying to kill me, and I'm just like, what the hell? He's, wow, he's sitting in our base now. Wait, I'm gonna trap him. Wait, I'm gonna trap him. Trap him. Finish me, bro. Finish me, bro. Hey, hey bro. Yeah, dude. Oh, hey. Friendly? Friendly? He's saying, hey, friendly. Wait, they're door camping me. Dude, I can't even explain. I can trap these guys so easily. I wanted to, they're, they were like mocking me, saying friendly. Like I was trying to give them the base. And now they're, I can't even get back inside. But no, they're sitting in the, the airlock. But every time I get close, they shoot me. So annoying. Oh. Wait, I'll just have, wait, I'll put the second door on, but have it facing the wrong way. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So it doesn't create airlock, because they saw that one was there. So it's simple. I bait them, they kill me. They see the doors open, they go in, we trap them. GG. <laughs> oh, they're there. Here, get up there, get up there, get up there, get up there, get up there. I'm waiting, I'm waiting. Alright, I died, not being able to get in. Wait, get ready, get ready, get ready. Wait for the box click. Wait, wait, wait. Are they leaving? I don't think they did. They may come back. They may have just gotten a lot. Hold on. Surely they're going to, they, they definitely saw that. I'm going to start running over from where I am now when I see him, uh, when I see them open their door. Yeah, I know. My name is Dante the Gamer. I play games, my name Johnson. Dude, they're <laughs> mocking me. Why are they mocking me? They might come in, they might come in. Get ready. Wait, wait, wait. wait. They have to see the door now. Why? The door is open, bro. I close the door. Open it again, open it again. Let him kill you. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna open it with a gun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Dude, how many taps do you need to give us, buddy? Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> They're both no, in. No 
way they fell for it, dude. Oh my god. Yo, should I just open it? No, 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 no. I want to talk to these. Hey, yo, how many Thompsons? Hey, hey, no. <laughs> dude, 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 dude. How many Thompsons are you going to give us, bro? <laughs> hey, buddy, it's me, Johnson, the gamer. Are they dead? <laughs> Yeah, move. I'm gonna get their <laughs> shit. <laughs> oh, he's on top of the thing. He's on. You can drop down and kill him. He's gonna be weak. His teammate's gonna be coming from outside, though. I got him when he's reloading. Uh, I'm friendly. Is he on the ground? Friendly. I am friendly. Hey, could you please stop giving us what have we yeah, I'll here? I'll just sit on your other five Tommies, man. <laughs> Look at this karma. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Little weasel. Okay. Well, that's all the satisfaction I needed. I was <laughs> gonna, the fact that I was gonna give these f the base, then they had to spray me down and mock me for what? feel bad for them just a little satisfaction before i went to sleep i mean i as the revenge artist couldn't just let these guys do me wrong as i was trying to help them out without at least a little payback coming their way they were the last victims of our trap base and because they mocked me and because they made it clear that they didn't want to speak with me at all although in their defense i was speaking in a russian accent they didn't get the base in fact no one did although most of the loot was transferred out of it anyways so if anyone were to raid it they wouldn't get much from it after this vo and i logged off for the night now again i can imagine you guys are curious why i uploaded this video how i did why I skipped the first day and a half of the story, which was like 10 to 12 hours of footage. The short answer is, this video is due today, when I'm releasing it, on this Sunday. This is my final Phase 5 submission, which is quite simply a collaboration with an existing Phase member, Phase Kaz. I think things went pretty solid for his first ever Rust experience. Now, speaking on what you guys did miss out on, there's a chance that my next video will chronicle the beginning of this adventure because there's just so much action that you all missed. The main focus of this video was the trap base, but that was not the main focus of this wipe. You guys don't know how it plays out, so who knows? It may be something entirely different. Whatever the case is, odds are by the time you're watching this video, I'm out on a Rust server somewhere having an entirely different adventure. And when my hands are all done and dusted with another glorious tale behind me, you all know that that story will come to your feed as soon as I can possibly make it happen. With all of that being said, it's time for our video to come to a close. My name's Stevie. Thank you so much for watching.